Hey friends, happy 2018. Happy 2018, guys. Sounds crazy. Sound like a like a like a former number. Like 2018. But we made it to 2018. And and that's you know, and, and that's <clears throat> That's great, okay, that we made it. A lot of people didn't make it in 2018, but you made it, guys. So, here's what I want to give you guys, right? Twenty eighteen has started. Nine out of ten people quit their New Year's resolution by February. I don't set New Year's resolutions. I just set monthly goals and I review my goals every day. Okay. If you woke up with a passion, a purpose, and a plan, you're on the right road. If you woke up just to go to work today, just to make a paycheck, you already starting off on the wrong path. If 2018, guys, is going to be different, this mind right here got to be different first. If you woke up this morning and said, I hate my job, I'm going to do something different in 2018. And you didn't do nothing towards moving forward for 2018 today, chances are you're not going to do anything in 2018. Here's what I've learned. If you're not willing to go above and beyond for yourself, no one will. If you're not willing to sacrifice for yourself, no one will. If you don't wake up with purpose, passion, and a plan, guess what? No one will give you passion. No one will give you a purpose and only your boss will give you a plan just to keep working for them. You have to have purpose, my friends. You have to have purpose. You have to have passion, guys, to keep going and change your life. It's not just good enough to wake up and say, I'm going to go to my job today, do the same bull crap I've been doing. I speak to a lot of people. And people call me and say, oh, Tanisha, when I save up my money, I'm going to get involved with what you're doing. And I tell people, no, you're not. You're not going to save up your money. And when you get the money, you're going to do what I'm doing. No, you're not. Oh, Tanisha, I'm, when soon as tax time come, you know, I'm going to drop two grand and get with you. No, you're not. Here's the thing, guys. Here's how it works. This is just how it works. If you are not willing to do it right now, if you're not willing to sacrifice a car note, if you're not willing to sacrifice not eating out, if you're not willing to sacrifice, okay, for what you want, when you get money, you're definitely not going to do it, guys. Because remember, people have the broke mind. So what happens around tax time or what happens around the time that you may have some money, now you feel like you got money. So you're not going to want to invest in yourself. You're not going to want to start a business because now you feel you got money. Until you go broke again, that's when you're like, oh, shit, I need to start me a business, right? It's all in your mind. I, I tell people all the time, if you are not willing to sacrifice today, for a better tomorrow, your tomorrow will continue to look the same way as today. You gotta have passion, you gotta have purpose, guys, and you gotta have a plan. I don't care if you're a single mom, I don't care if you're 65 years old, I don't care if you got bills out your ass, okay? If you are not willing to get started today, believe me, my friend, you won't. Because there's no real motivation for you. There's no motivation. What is your motivation? To start a business besides money. Right, you have no motivation. So when you get your taxes, or tax time come to give you half your money back, 
or a quarter of your money back. Now you feel like you got money, so you don't need to start a business no more because now you got money. What is your motivation, your passion, your purpose, and your plan of living? Are you living on purpose? Are you living with passion? Are you living with a plan? Or, or you're hoping and praying and wishing that something great happens. See, great people go make things happen. Everybody else just wish for great things to happen to them. You gotta make a decision, guys. If you can't sacrifice today and say, you know what, Tanisha, I know your Amazon course is 500. I'm willing to pay you $500 because I know that Amazon works. <laughs> Amazon, everybody in their mother shops on Amazon. If I can just make a thousand a month, I'll be happy. But if you're not willing to sacrifice your car note, you worry about your car note, <laughs> believe me, if you worried about one car payment that you're gonna miss, you already behind, baby. You already behind on that car note. Believe me, if you're working, if the money you made this month is the money that you're paying bills with this month, you are already behind. So missing one car payment ain't gonna change the course of no kind of life for you. Missing one house note <laughs> ain't going to change no kind of course of your life for you. Right? <laughs> Missing one credit card payment ain't going to change no course of your life for you. What is your plan? What is your passion? What is your purpose? People commit suicide because they don't have a plan. They're not passionate about nothing and they can't find purpose. Everything has a purpose. My car has a purpose. This water has a purpose. My glasses has a purpose. This hat has a purpose. This receipt has a purpose. This hair bow has a purpose. My bag has a purpose. This uh, smell good has a purpose. This phone has a purpose. But when it comes to human beings, purpose goes right out the damn door you got to have a purpose guys life is to be lived on purpose life is to be lived the way you want to live life is to be lived with a passion and planning not oh I'm gonna get taxes and now I'm be good no you're not because if you're not interested in investing in yourself now, when you got to sacrifice for it, when you got a little bit of money, you're definitely not going to sacrifice. When you save up the money, you're definitely not going to spend it because now you feel you got some money. Guys, money is only a tool. It's an energy. Why do most people don't have money? Because they don't have the energy of money. They push money away. They know how to get rid of money. They don't know how to get on how to get it. They know how to keep it. And they damn sure don't know how to multiply it. You gotta know how to get money, guys. To keep it and then to multiply it. That's why when people get involved with me with Amazon, what I simply do, okay? All I simply do is I get them set up now with a Bitcoin account. Start them. You know, they enter to win $100. Whoever wins the $100 in Bitcoin, now I'm going to show them how to multiply their money. Now I'm going to show them how to multiply their money. I'm going to show them how to get money, and I'm going to show them how to multiply it. Now it's up to them to learn how to keep it. So like I said, guys, if you're not living with purpose and passion and a plan, the three Ps, You won't ever, ever do nothing significant in your life, guys. You gotta have a purpose. You gotta have a plan. You gotta have passion. 2018 is just started. Do you know you have the power to write each day? You have the power to get up every day and write out what you're going to accomplish and feel accomplished, but this is only if you have a plan and passion and purpose. If money is your only motivation to start in a business, don't do it. Because once you're not making money, you are going to quit. Most people quit. 
what is the purpose of a business? What is the purpose of you starting something new? Just to make money, then don't do it because you have a job. Your job, the purpose of you going to your job is to make money and you hate your job. So therefore, you fucking hate money because you can't never keep it. Okay, now this ain't for everybody. There's some people that got a lot of money. There's some people just got 100000 sitting and they don't know what to do with it. Now they find my video and I tell them what to do with it. Now they now they happy with what they did with their money. The purpose of you going to a job is to make money. You hate your job, so you hate money. So now that's why you're trying to get out your job. So now you want to start a business for the same reason, just to make money? You're going to quit as soon as you don't make money. Make better decisions, guys, starting today for a better life tomorrow. If you don't sacrifice, if you don't go through pain short term now, it's going to be long term pain for the rest of your life. People are 65 years old right now, guys. They cannot seem to get the fuck ahead at 65 because they didn't do something different besides work a dead end job under 50 you got time on your side but don't take it for granted over 50 you got one foot in the grave and you got one foot in quicksand and you trying to pull yourself out the grave you gotta make a decision plan today so tomorrow can be brighter so what you may be in a dark space right now so the fuck what Trouble don't last always. 2018, guys. Purpose. Passion. Okay? Planning. Purpose. Passion. Planning. Are you going to be a part of 1% of people who's living their life, doing what they want to do, without money worries, without bill worries? Or you're going to be a part of 99% of people Who's worried about money every day? Who can't pay their bills? Who's up to here with bills? Who's trading hours for dollars and will continue to trade hours for dollars until they're 80 years old? When are you going to start living? I get paid 10 to 20 grand a month to live. Ain't that something? Ain't that something? 10 to 20 grand a month to live funny right meanwhile people getting paid 20 grand a year to kill themselves with blood sweat and tears the average person makes 50 grand a year and they only really see about 35 30 35 thousand dollars a year because the government takes half of the damn for, for taxes so are you gonna live or work a very thin line my friends a very thin line Passion, purpose, and planning. Let's make 2018 better, guys. Let's just make 2018 better. Right? Why you why you gotta suffer? Why you gotta keep suffering? Why you gotta keep struggling? Why money always gotta be a problem? Why? Because you are not making the decisions. Why you always gotta tell your kids, oh, you can't get it until pay fucking day? Why every day can't be a fucking payday? 2018, guys, is here. It's here. I'm not talking about it, it, it's going to be here in two hours in, or two days. It's here now. What are you going to do? Fuck a New Year's resolution. Because people quit the shit in 30 days and totally forget about the New Year's resolution. Oh, yeah, I had one. Huh. I didn't follow fuck through. I don't do your New Year's resolutions. I just do monthly goals. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> I just set monthly goals, monthly targets, and achieve them. Period. Simple. <laughs> Simple as fucking that. Passion. Purpose. Planning. Are you living on purpose? Set up your free Bitcoin, guys. Set, Get involved with Bitcoin. Set your free account up. Fund your account with at least 150 bucks. Okay? Start getting some daily interest, especially if you just got money sitting in the bank. Get some daily interest on your money. Understand how your money can work for you. You can also set up a retirement with Bitcoin for yourself, 
fuck life insurance. Take your money out of your life insurance and put it into Bitcoin. Take your money out of your 401k and all the other bullshit, okay, and put it into Bitcoin, okay? At the end of the day, guys, planning and having a purpose and having a passion for what you do, guys, will separate you from the 99.9% .9 of losers in the world. Make a decision. I did. BitcoinTanisha.net. Set your free account up. You want to get involved with Amazon, guys. I've been doing Amazon for over a year. Made over 100K just with Amazon. Huh? I love Amazon. Amazon loves me. And you could be sitting in the same position. But if you don't make a decision, you won't. See you soon, guys.